Happy holidays everyone, it's Ian Parallax here and I've literally shot this intro like 20 times. I just am so excited, there's so much I want to say. We have content out the wazoo, Prophet Summon, Heroic Miracle, Grey Dwarfs, monthly events. We are going to try to get and uh, take a 7 star Valk to an E3 Valk and there is just so much content, so much fun. I literally want to tell you guys all of it and I just don't even know. So. What we're going to do is we're going to see and take as much as we can in this just one event and make a ton of progress. So stick with me. Let's have some fun and see how far we get. It's that holiday season, everyone. I have, I think, three and a half more days of work. And then I am done. I hope you, some of you guys are probably already finished school. Hopefully none of you have to work or do anything over the holiday season. But with this event, we got a new look. And again, just a massive drop of events and um, gains to be made, basically. So there's so much I want to do. And I think I already started a little bit of it. I, tr I made some fusions. Um... I've been kind of doing the militant event, or excuse me, the tavern quest. Uh, I did a little bit of the heroic miracle. So what we are going to do, and like I usually like to do, is we're going to start with heroic miracle. I am going to find, uh, I, I've told you this before, I like being able to have all of the heroes kind of at my disposal to see um, what choices I need to make um, when it comes to the other events, namely... Um, profit summon so I'm pretty sure we're gonna go forest because as I told you in the intro I am trying to get Valk from a seven star to e3 uh, and I'm going to try my hardest to make that happen um, simply for the fact is I want I want to get her to e3 I want to use the gray dwarfs blessing to get her ranger gear and I just want to see her do work um, so to start off, let's just take a look at my bags. Um, we have quite a few um, five-star heroes um, to summon. So we're going to go through and summon all of them, except uh, we're going to conserve like I normally do the light and dark heroes. So just to make sure we're doing everything correctly. Again, yep, two light, two dark. Pretty, pretty standard. So let's go and see what we get. We have 12 normal so let's see if there's anything out of the ordinary a pretty good spread we got three abyss um two two uh fortress two forest and two shadow so oh, three shadow so that alone probably was enough to uh to get us what we needed nothing fancy let's see what we get here again nothing too fancy um here is where let us see. Oh, cool. I like that. That's cool. I don't know when they added that, but you could see what we could get. So really, I could definitely use a Valk or a Shia. I don't know if you guys watched it, but we did a lot of work trying to pronounce all these heroes right. So we have Shia. Uh, we have Vesa. Um, and don't really want her. Um, I do want a Shia and a Valk. Um, so either of those would be good. Heck, I'd take, I'd take something. So let's just, we're, we're, we're rooting, for, we need more Valk copies. And we get, drum roll, <laughs> I cursed it. I literally should have said I didn't want Valk and I would have got a Valk. But regardless, that's okay. Uh, another forest hero um, to probably use as fodder. So going through, we're just going to finish, uh, get Cthuga. We're just going to go through, clear out my bag space of non-light and dark heroes because whatever I don't use is going to be either used as fodder um, or will be used as uh, fodder. So <laughs> um, we're going to go forward. Um, maybe, probably KB. I am going to build KB. KB is a monster in PvP um, and has single-handedly destroyed... Like a E3, um, um, KB has done nutso amount of damage on me. So we're going to probably try to build him. 
We got some SIG to build. And I just want to let you guys know I am so pumped. I've been wanting to make this video. I've been kind of just holding off, trying like not making too, too much progress. I'm waiting so I could do it all in one go. And it seems that now this is my main, this is the main uh, monthly um, or week of the month to make progress. I think it happened last time. It's that Heroic Miracle Profit Orb combo event where I just love to make huge progress. I clear out my backspace, so we're going to try to go through um, 5,000 four-star hero shards, 4,000 three-stars. Um, we're going to come over here, and we'll go ahead. We'll save those right now for space-wise. Uh, we'll do DA and a DOS mog. So it's two. We'll do one there. Make sure we only summon one, not four. And we should be done the Heroic Miracle. I would be surprised if we are not. Yet we got the Sig there. So heck, how many copies? We might have enough copies of Sig to get him to E... Or at least uh, E... Let's see, E2. Or E1 at least. Let's see. I keep going back. We have one back there. Going through... Sig, 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 Sig. There you are. So one, two... For, yep, we could definitely get them to E3. 2 to 10 star, 1 to E1, that other one in bags to E2. Obviously, I don't think I'm going to get Sig there. But after I get, um, I think we're working on Priest. Or no, do we max Priest, Guild Tech? Not to get off subject, but Warrior is the next. Oh, we're already working on Warrior Tech. Warrior is the next tech that we are going to max out. Um, and then really just have Mage, but I'm not too concerned about Mage right now. Um, we are going to be focusing on getting warrior. So already we we summoned good goodness gracious knows how many five star heroes and already heroic miracle complete. Um, so we're going to go through and let's just evaluate. Try to make so okay. So we need one to get her to nine star, two for ten star. I have enough, not this, I keep hitting the wrong button. I have enough to get uh, at least to E1. So we're going to drop my profit orbs all on forest, I think, um, just to get forest fodder. Because I want to get, like I said, my sole focus is to speed run and get Valk to as E3 or E2 as quickly as I can. So taking a look. 80s the first run, not really feeling flame strike. Um, Corpse Demon, I mean it's okay. War Wards are decent. I really the 15 glorious relics is the big one. So we're gonna hold off. We have enough gems as you can see saved, and we can make um, enough that we'll probably be able to get another set of Ranger or whatever gear we choose. Hopefully Ranger. Um, not going to do broken spaces. So let's let's go. Let's see how many we have. Only 42. Oh man. So we are low on profit orbs. Um quite low. What can we do? Wow. I did not realize how many of those I have. So I think heck could buy a few icons that I missed. I will eventually get all the icons. Um so, let's see. That would be 30, no, 10 would be 2019. So we can get 19 profit orbs from the arena, which obviously we're going to do. That will put us at 70, right now 50, no, 60, excuse me, my math. My math skills after work. Um, so 70-ish. So heck, I might even buy I'll probably buy 10, but we're going to hold off right now. Actually, we can start. I haven't, and this is one thing I haven't done very well. I haven't been buying the profit orbs um, daily from the market. So especially now you can get, what, two a day if I, with the event going on and all that. So let's just do this. We're going we're gonna to cash in this check for 19 profit orbs which is a huge. Let's take a look too because we might be able to push through um, 
um, talking tavern event. So, um, that's where, if I get another 7 star this month, or this week, that would be another 10, which would put me in a good spot. I know I have one 7 star right now. Um, so we're just going to have to hope. Uh, maybe, maybe we won't need to hope. Let's just try it. Ready? Luck with me. Come on. Nah, not the best. Oh, well, we'll, we'll rock it. So we got, we're going to go forward and we'll use 62. Yeah, so I need 18. So that would put me, we're just going to use 62. Uh, I'll probably purchase a little pack the holiday season. Uh, I need those 15 glorious relics. So, But not right now. We're just going to do a regular 62 profit orb forest summoning. I'm feeling one at a time here to start. Um, we'll do maybe there. Alrighty, enough one at a time. We're going to do a 10 summon. Here we go. We want Valk copies and 5 stars. Valk copies and 5 stars. So 1... Mm, that's okay. Or two. That's good. I'll take two. Let's go again. Oh, none. That hurts. Oh, that was really bad. Gugh. Oh, man. We need better than this. Come on, luck. Oh, man. We are getting... They do not want us to get Valk today. They do not. There's one. Oh, man. We're struggling. We're struggling. Last ten summon. Alrighty, we got another one. That was a little bit rough. We're going to go back. No Valk copies. We are going to try to go here to Heroes. Oh, no, we'll go back to Bag. Excuse me. We're going to summon these five-star forests. We're going to summon, summon, summon. Uh, we're going to go through. We're going to summon these guys as well. We're going... All out, we're going to summon all the four stars as we can until we run out of bag space. And then we're going to, I think we just ran out of bag space, yep. Alrighty, so now is the time we finished. Um, there's another five star that we could summon. So we completely, or almost, actually we didn't completely, we almost finished the um, profit. I need 18 more profit orbs, which we will might probably just purchase. Um... And maybe we might wait to try to get ten from the from the from the uh, what is it tavern quest, and we might only need to purchase ten or so. Um, or I could just probably do some work, uh, but I have to wait till the trial of champions open up to get five more. We'll probably just go for it, buy a pack. We'll see weekly packages. Ooh, yeah, costly. But we'll we'll see about that. Now, I'm going to take a look. Let's take a look at our bags. Um, really, we want to go and start creating some, any five stars that we can. And looking at it, there is a lot going on here. So I am going to clean up all the bags, all the, or all the summons. We're going to finish fusion. Right, so we did the prep work, we did the heroic uh, miracle, we did most of the prophet summoning, actually before prophet tree summons. We're going to do some replacement here as before I fiddle around with any of that other stuff. Before I do, just to make sure I don't use something we need, so we need one there. Alright, it's okay. I'm just figuring out which here I'm going to use for the replacement because I've done that so many times before. I'm like, oh, look at me. I'm going to go and use this here as a replacement. And I replace a hero that I needed to get a six star. And it's just counter counterproductive. So here we go. Windwalker. Do, 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 do. All righty. We're going to get a Vesa. We're going to get at least. Ah, I said it wrong too. No, I'm cursing myself. Ve Vesa. We are, don't want a Vesa. We already got one. We want a Valk. So I'm, I'm fighting. I'm fighting within myself trying to not pronounce these here names wrong. And I can't revert back to my old ways. So we are going to get a Valk. I feel it. Hopefully. Um, I have at least one in me. Okay, we don't need Rosa. Come on, Valk. Don't hide from me. Six more tries, everyone. Five. Four, come on, I need your guys' luck. Here we go, do 
three. Alrighty, two more tries. Oh, alrighty. Get pumped. I, I, I really need one. I really need one Valk or we're not even going to be able to get, I think, an E1 Valk out of this. So, do one more try. Windwalker, it is not. Ugh. So that one, we only needed one to get an E2, excuse me, because I could use the um, Glorious Relic. So that is kind of a bummer. Not very many five stars. No Valk. So struggling a little bit. We are going to go through, though, and we're going to put some work. We're going to cook some food up. We're going to make six stars. We're going to make five stars. And we are going to make them until I can power up Awaken Valk as high as she can go. Uh, we are going to at least E1, hopefully, if everything works out as planned. So I'm going to go through. I'm going to clean up, make as much food, not only for Forest, but all of the rest. And that is probably not going to lie, take about 30 or 40 minutes um, to go through bags and, and do it correctly. Um, just to let you guys know what I have to go through is I always will, I'll make as many five stars as I can. I'll check how many four stars I have for each faction. I'll go back and try to balance my summons between four and three star because I think that's a good learning experience for everyone. Uh, you can't always just summon a max amount of the four stars because, right, you're not going to be able to supply them with three. So it's a, it's a balancing act going between four stars, or excuse me, four star, three star heroes, so I can you can keep making at least one or two hero each round to free up some more bag space. Because sadly, I'm, I am VIP 7, but not VIP 13. Bag space is always an issue. Um, but for now, I'm going to take a quick little break, and when I see you guys next, I will go over all the heroes we made, uh, or not all the heroes, any major heroes and just show you the bags before and after and we'll see what we can make.